one day, nurses came in and said, there's this wonderful Brazilian group who are singers. Could they come into my room and sing? I said, absolutely. And I remember distinctly you guys in your beautiful white shirts, the way you were all dressed, singing the most beautiful, uplifting music. And I know that I was doing the samba in my bed. Not only am I a survivor, I'm still going through my treatment and I'm able to bring a level of hope and explain to our patients through the programs that you do that we must keep on going and life is good. residents are able to communicate or move, but yet when the music starts playing and they start singing and sharing their love, suddenly you'll see a little hand start moving, a little movement, a little smile on their faces, and that might be all we have for the day, but that made a difference in their lives for that moment in time. I'm really uh, happy that you guys come over to the hospital, uh, you know, uh, your voices are beautiful, very soothing. I'm pretty sure that the patient also loved that as well. Under a lot of stress and illness and disease and pain, I think what you guys are doing is really, really commendable. So thank you very much. I was at Memorial Hospital Pembroke, I was walking down the hall, and I heard these beautiful voices coming from a room. And I stopped and I listened, and as they came out, they said, Yeah, we sing. This is what we do. It's been wonderful. I've had nothing but just outstanding feedback from everybody. It's been wonderful. We love to have you here. And that is the gift that you guys bring to us right here in the hospital. And for that, we are eternally grateful. Thank you.